Hello again, it's me, Kim Coleman. Today we're talking about avatars in membership sites. I'm gonna show you how to add an avatar plugin that's free and compatible with Paid Memberships Pro so your members can update their profile picture throughout your membership site. Let's get started. I'm logged into my Must Love Dogs demo site and I wanna show you how WordPress by default handles user avatars. So if you go to settings discussion in your membership site and scroll down, you'll see a section um, that's built into WordPress about avatars. So this is the area that lets you turn off the display of avatars throughout the membership site, throughout your WordPress site. And then you can also customize the default avatar. And this is used when the user email address doesn't have a Gravatar. So what is a Gravatar? A Gravatar is another open source initiative that allows people to update their email address and assign an image for a profile picture that can be used with any web application or service or WordPress that all support Gravatars. So if your user already has a Gravatar set up, it's gonna show up um, within the membership site. So for example, here's a directory of members in this Must Love Dogs demo site. None of these users have a Gravatar set up for their email address. So it's showing that default mystery man icon in WordPress. So if we wanted to give people the ability to customize their avatars, um, let's do that now. Um, go to plugins, add new and search for basic user avatars. The same team, our team that's behind Pay Memberships Pro manages this plugin also. So once this is activated, nothing majorly changes in the site initially. What it does do is activate on the backend WordPress edit profile screen, a section to set and upload an avatar right here. So if I, as the admin was logged in and wanted to edit my profile, I could use this form to navigate to my website in the backend, upload a file from my computer and use that as my avatar. Once I locate the image, I would just save my profile and update, and then that's updated to override and use this image instead of my Gravatar. If you wanna give your users access to update their avatar photos as well, you wouldn't necessarily want them to be logged into the backend of your WordPress site, and depending on how you have Paid Memberships Pro Advanced Settings configured, they might not be able to. So if you wanna use basic user avatars in combination with Paid Memberships Pro, what I like to do is add it to this edit profile screen. So this is the default profile screen in Paid Memberships Pro. If you edit it, you'll see that it has the profile edit block already set up on the page. So below this block, what you can do is insert another block, which would be a short code, which is what's supported by basic user avatars. And the format of this short code is just basic-user-avatars and that's it. So let's update this and see what we've done on the front end of the site. So you still have your same form, and then below that you have a section that allows people to customize their avatar. We already customized our avatar. We could use this form if I was a user to delete that local avatar, or we could upload a new avatar and override this one. So it gives people an easy way to manage their profile picture. If you're logged in as admin of the site, you can also update an individual user's avatar. Let's say you wanted to edit it on behalf of one of your users. So you would just navigate to all users, select a user to edit, and then from here, you could locate a file to upload or a file they shared with you and click update user. And then that would also be reflected right there in your membership site. So it's pretty cool. These two plugins work really well together. It adds a functionality that we don't have in Core Paid Memberships Pro, I don't know that we will be adding it. Um, and then with these plugins, with basic user avatars, that's the avatar used across the entire WordPress site. So if you have a community feature like BuddyPress, if you have commenting on blog posts, if you have something like BBPress for forums and community interaction, it's gonna pull that user avatar for all of these places. So it gives one central place where people can manage their profile and edit their avatar picture without too much trouble. It's a pretty lightweight plugin, so I hope you go check it out. Thanks so much for watching. Stay tuned, like, and subscribe to this channel, and we'll be publishing more PM Pro tutorials. Thanks so much.